The inspiration came from the United States. I saw the success of Substack newsletters in the United States. And I suppose I saw that the model worked. And the key there is that if you write online, another additional subscriber doesn't cost anything. So that could lead to pure profit. And with scale, it can potentially become profitable. My scale is, is still relatively small, but over time you can grow that. And to me, that was an attractive business model. And I also felt that there, there's a lack of information outside of the newspapers. There are some newspapers who do job like the edge for example but overall i think that there's not much out there and i f felt that i could probably provide that perspectives and guide not necessarily guide but just talk about different trends i'm writing what i would like to read myself basically as an investor or someone who's just interested in companies in in the region and i think that there's also a case to be made that if you're based somewhere else it's interesting to know what are the parallels of what we're seeing in the US, for example, in China. So trying to open up people's minds in a way.